All right, it's revealed what the Pistons are asking to return for Derrick Rose services in the trade. Let's talk about it. We back, Marcy Sports Talk. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. Appreciate the love, support, and uh, let's get to it. So the Pistons are asking for a first round draft pick. I'll link uh, source in the description so you can check it out. And that's what they asked for around the league. Um, Clippers, Lakers, Sixers are all interested in Derrick Rose. So that's what they're asking for. Um, I think that's that's good. I think that's what they should ask for. They had won the first round pick for Andre Drummond. The difference is not that Derrick Rose is playing at a higher clip than Andre Drummond and got more potential. At this point, which he don't, it's the fact that Derrick Rose is under contract next year for just over $7 million in today's NBA for the points and the production he's giving you. He probably will give you off the bench. That's a great value. So the Pistons are probably looking to trade him to a championship contender, a playoff contender in the late 20s, probably just outside the lottery uh, or the late 20s. So they asked for first-round draft pick for, for Derrick Rose. Um, like I said before, if they can throw Kuzma in there in a Derrick Rose the potential deal, I, would, I wouldn't even care about the first-round draft pick. But uh, Derrick Rose is playing really, really well right now. He healthy, um, balling. He twisted his ankle a little bit yesterday. Uh, Reggie gave you a little bit yesterday. Um 22 points with 19 minutes. That's probably going to be anomaly more than the norm, but Pistons are in total rebuild mode. And it's interesting to see which domino fall, fall first, Andre Drummond, Derrick Rose, or do they get packaged together, which I probably really don't see happening unless it's a three-team deal or more. But first-round draft pick, that's straight. You know, that's adequate compensation. Um, you know, for a guy that was just supposed to come here and kind of be like a filler. Derrick Rose is almost played at an all-star clip. If he played more minutes, I think definitely he'd probably be an all-star starter. Or probably be an all-star voted by the coaches. But we'll see. We'll see. You know, as the trade deadline get close, if one team make a big trade, then somebody else going to try to compete with them. So Domino got to fall first. We had a couple small trades. Ken Bay's more. And there was another trade as well in there. Uh, so, you know, it'd be interesting to see. Uh, where Derrick Rose falls at if they do trade Derrick Rose. And if Derrick Rose wants to be traded, he said he hasn't really thought about it. But, you know, how he playing right now, you know, you think to add on to his Hall of Fame resume, if he were to get into the Hall of Fame, a championship would be nice. And being a contributor while being in champ, uh, on a championship team. And then also that's good for the Adidas campaign. You know, if Derrick Rose is hooping in the finals or hooping in the playoffs, he may get a finals or, or a playoff edition shoe or something like that. So, you know, the way he balling, if he can go somewhere else and kind of, you know, come off the bench and do that and get and, and be a star off the bench, that's good for Adidas. It's good for Derrick Rose. It's good for his comeback of the year story. But um, a first-round draft pick, that's sufficient. I, I like that. But, you know, I wouldn't deal him unless I was, I was for sure, sure I couldn't get Kyle Kuzma off the Lakers. I know if I, I mean I think he'd be an integral part of getting Kyle Kuzma um from the Lakers. Marquise Morris will be a part of that as well too. Um and if I can get Kyle Kuzma, they can keep the first round draft pick. But I think Derrick Rose is gonna be easier to trade than Andre Drummond because the security of him be signed signed for next year and him being healthy. But I have a feeling if the Pistons hold on to him, the injury gonna end up coming and then he not gonna have no value. Same with Blake Griffin. But we'll see if they learn from their mistake. We'll see who uh who willing to deal for Derrick Rose. But I think it's going to be a big domino that fall first. Maybe the Pistons with the big domino. I know the Mavericks, they already looking at alternative uh, ways uh, other than Andre Drummond. So they're going to probably be out the Drummond sweepstakes if they sign Joaquin Noah. So it's going to be interesting to see if Milwaukee, Philadelphia, Boston, Indiana make a big deal in the East. Or Houston, uh, the Lakers, the, Cl the Clippers, you know, teams like that, Denver. One of them make a big, big trade in the West, and I think the dominoes will fall from there with everybody trying to compete with each other for a championship. I'm being here, and Danilo Gallinari could be dealt to the 76ers or a few other teams, so we'll see what happens. But I think, you know, that deal that the Sixers sent, that wasn't a good deal for the Pistons. So, you know, unless you feel that Desire Smith kid going to come in and contribute and be a star. But, hey, Motor City Sports Talk, I'll link the source in the description so you can check it out. Don't forget we're on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Reach out to the email if you have a business question, cards, you want to see a video request. Don't forget to check my other channel out, Goodfellas Sports TV on YouTube for more sports news, entertainment. One time for the one time. It's your boy CJ Goodfellas, Marty Sports Talk. We gone.